Hey everybody, I'm Dougie. I'm Rose. And welcome back to Collecting Together. Today we have another dollar store haul for you. Um, I think it's about six pops. Uh, some some pretty cool ones. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, this last time we went, they had they had quite a bit, so we, we picked <laughs> up uh, picked up quite a few. <laughs> Maybe more than we should have. <laughs> yeah. And then uh, we had a few from before that we were planning to film. So now we got about three videos worth. Yeah. Of dollar store pops. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, let's check them out. Alright, the first one is from The Blacklist or Blacklist Elizabeth Keene. I have no idea about this show whatsoever. And I only know it's a show because it says television mm -hmm. on it. I guess there's only two in that set, though. Yeah, I've never heard of this show either. like a CIA type pop or something. Um, huh. But it looks like she has like a badge right there or something. She has a gun though. Yeah. But huh. hmm. uh, the next one we have is another lost one and it's Jacob and I don't know what that is I think it's a bottle of like a glass of wine or something hmm. oh yeah I think all our lost pops we we got at the dollar store yeah we did <laughs> but uh yeah, I think it's just a glass of wine. I think that's what it's supposed to be. Yeah, it looks more like it on the box. Oh. Uh, it's cool. hard to tell though just by the pop. Yeah. Uh, next we have is Rhonda Rousey. Man, I feel so bad for it. that. Like, I'm not into UFC or anything. Like, I don't. I'm not a like a watcher. Like, I don't know what goes on in the world of UFC, but. Yeah. I remember she was like really popular, like really popular, like for a second, and then she played, she fought that one match with the other lady, and she got like knocked out, and it seemed like that just, like all the. She knocked the other lady out, and then they made a whole bunch of memes about her. No, she got. Uh, this this lady right here got knocked out from the challenger because she was like a champion or something like that. But uh, after that happened, like she just seemed to have disappeared a bit. Like you don't really hear about her all that much anymore. That's weird because they just released another pop of her. Oh, did they? Yeah. Oh, I think that was um, like a wrestling one, right? Like it's WWF. Um. um she's then like that's the series. Yeah. Didn't she like, like appear that. on the episode or something? Uh, probably. I haven't seen any WWF in so long. <laughs> um. I, I think I what I saw them. A uh, short video of it. Mm. The only the only thing I, I actually know her from is Expendables Three. Oh yeah. She was the the bouncer in the club or something, but she like joins the team. Huh. I think I'm pretty sure that's her. But yeah. Hmm. All right. So our next one is from Once Upon a Time, and it is Belle. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, I really like that show. You said it's just like characters from like Disney movies, right? Yeah. And they're all like interacting with each other. Yeah. That's pretty cool. I, I like. I haven't seen any of it, but I mean, it sounds like a really cool idea. I think you've caught bits and pieces of it. Because I mean, I, I would. Uh, I, I I would love like you know like a like a say like a animated movie of all the Nicktoons together. Oh. Like that would be cool, you know. Yeah, I think they had like seven seasons of the show too. Why does she have a dagger? Um, I think it's from one specific episode. Mm hmm. Cool. Nice pop. Yeah, uh, she actually falls in love with Rumpelstiltskin. Oh, yeah? Yeah, and they called him the Beast. Oh. So. I was about to ask, what about the Beast? <laughs> in that show, he is the Beast. Oh, nice. And 
uh, we have another Once Upon a Time, Prince Charming. So who's, is that supposed to be from Snow White? Yeah. Do you know what the prince's name is from, um, what is it called? The other popular <laughs> Disney movie, uh, Sleeping Beauty. Um. Does he have a name? Philip, maybe? Is it? Um, like some of those classic ones, mm -hmm. <laughs> a lot of their names, you don't know what the hell the heck their names are. <laughs> Yeah. Like the princes. The only prince I remember hearing the name was Prince Eric from Little Mermaid. Yeah. Isn't it from Beauty and the Beast? It's like Prince Adam or something. Uh, I, I don't know. Prince Adam. Mm. I don't know. It's more the more recent ones that are actually giving names and mm -hmm. giving more personality to the princes too. Prince Adam? Isn't that a uh, He-Man? That is He-Man, but I think it, it was also in Disney. Uh, but I could be just... <laughs> yeah, because uh, when you said Prince Adam, I, I was like, man, that sounds super familiar. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, I don't know. I have to look it up, see what all the heck their names are. Right. See if even all of them even have names. So, our last one for this one is Rose Tyler from Doctor Who. I was so excited to find this one. So, who is she? She is the Doctor's companion. Oh, you said each different Doctor has like a different buddy, right? Uh, yeah, and sometimes they, they have more than one. Huh. Do you have any Doctors? Yeah. Oh, yeah, you do. I've got like three of them, I think. Alright, so here's this uh, rose. Huh. Rose, I didn't even notice. Rose? <laughs> um. Oh, look, her head spins. <laughs> All the way around. Yeah. That's, That's cool different. looking. Cool looking pop, I guess. Yeah. Well, the job of the companion for mm -hmm. the viewers is to kind of make it more relatable. Uh huh. So they understand what's going she on. She has a little pink bow or something. Cool. Billy Piper. Who's that? The woman that plays Rose. Oh. Cool. Yeah, um... She was with two different doctors. Hmm. The ninth doctor mm -hmm. and then the tenth doctor. And then she makes an appearance with... The 11th Doctor, too. Mm -hmm. That's cool. So, uh, which was your favorite? <laughs> Rose? Is it Rose? Yeah. yeah. Yeah, it's pretty cool when you find uh, pops at the Dollar Store that you actually like really want. Yeah. Like, that's cool. I like that. Yeah, I didn't think I was going to find her. Uh, Leah, yeah, this last time we went, they had a Yellow Ranger there. Uh, from Power Rangers, and but we had already bought it, like, just recently, too, so that was kind of a bummer. <laughs> Too bad we don't wait. There was yeah. something else there too that we had just. Oh, the um, the Ragnarok Helena. Uh, Helena. Yeah. She was there too, and we had just bought her. <laughs> so it was a bummer. Yeah. But uh, I I like this Rhonda Rhonda one right here. It's, yeah. I just like the way the pop looks and uh, this bell. It's pretty cool too. Yeah, I'm always excited to find the Once Upon a Time ones. Yeah, I think that's your third one from the dollar store, right? Yeah. Yeah, Hook with Excalibur was Oh, the... no. I got him from uh, GameStop. Oh. Did you pick up any from uh, Once Upon a Time from um, the Dollar Store besides these two? I, I thought you know. did. I thought so, too, but I'm guessing not, then, if mm. I only have three of them. Yeah. All right, cool. Uh, so, for you guys watching, have you been uh, going to your local 99-cent store and finding any pops? Have you found any more of the Doctor Who ones, if you're interested in Doctor Who? Yeah, because the other ones that we found from Doctor Who was the Sarah Jane and the War Doctor. That was it, right? No, I, um, I think the majority of the Doctor Who ones we actually got from the dollar store. Well, besides the one that we have here, you have four. And I, I know for sure the War Doctor and Sarah Jane. 
we got there, and I know that uh, that one like white blob looking thing Oedipus. was from uh, Buy, Buy Sell, Sell Trade. Trade. It was the other one that we got. The from. Ninth Doctor. Yeah, we got him from the dollar store. Oh, cool. All right, nice. Uh, yeah, cool. So I guess that's gonna do it for us. Thanks for stopping by and hanging out, and we'll see you guys next time. Bye.